Good morning, happy Saturday to my YT fam, my YT fam, my YT fam, my YT fam. Welcome to my video, welcome to my live, welcome to our house, my YT fam. Hey, 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 my YT fam, my YT fam. Welcome to my video, welcome to my live, welcome to our house, my YT fam. Hey, hey, okay, let's get into it. Um, as y'all know, my name is Sherry, and this is my channel, uh, Sherry's Family Channel, and, um, I'm coming to talk for a little bit, and, like I said before, you know, when I first started this channel, you know, it hadn't been too long ago, it was sometime last year, I wanted to create this channel because, you know, I'm praying to God for me to become a mother. And the first thing that I want to get straight, you know, like I said, y'all, if some of you all wants to pray for me, I would greatly appreciate it that you pray for me to become a mother. For, for uh, some of you all, that don't want to pray for me and you feel like I don't deserve to become a mother then do like this don't say nothing keep your thoughts to yourself because you know what I'm gonna tell you something and it's coming from my heart I know how to take care of kids I used to babysit I used to babysit my nieces and nephews I babysitted other people's kids. And if back there in the day, back back in the days, if they felt like I wasn't capable enough to take care of their kids, why would why would they bring their kids to me? I babysit I babysitted some kids that that weren't even none of mine. They was a friend of mine that I used to hang around with. If she felt like her kids was going to be in harm's way, in danger, why would, she, why would she bring her kids to me? So, if you feel like you don't want to pray for me, that you think I'm going to be a bad mother to my child, you want to come and ask me all these questions, how you going to provide for your child, how you going to do this, you know. I know kids cost a lot. I know I know that. I used to be a kid once. But my mama still had me. Amen. So I'm not I'm not I'm not I'm not I'm just talking. I'm not mad, I'm not upset. No, I don't have no reason to be upset. But when I come on here and I say, well, uh, if some of you all don't mind, pray for me that I do become a mother. And if some of you all don't want to pray for me, then do like this. Keep your mouth shut. That's all I'm asking. Because I love each and every one of you all. But the devil is a liar. The devil is not for to steal my joy. I'm not going to let nobody steal my joy. If you think I can't provide for my child, then you got one thing coming. And that's between you and God. You don't know me. All you know is me from YouTube. All you know is me from on a camera. So, you know... I, I'm I'm not a messy person. I don't like I don't like to start mess. I love to get along with in and I love to get along with everybody. But if I feel like you gonna put me down, you gonna try to steal my joy. Mm mm, it's not gonna work. I love you. But if it was you that wanted to become a mother. I would definitely pray for you. I really would. But when I come on here, oh, it's like, you know, 
It's like you don't want to pray for me because you think I'm gonna be a bad mother. If I was a bad, if I was a bad, if I, if I was gonna be a bad mother, do you think God will allow me to bring a child into my life? That's up to God. God knows how I treat kids. I ain't never treated no kids wrong. I love kids with all my heart. With all my heart. And if I was, you know, that's just like about little Gigi. If I, if God knew that, you know, I was mistreating Gigi, I wouldn't be blessed with Gigi right today. But God blessed me with Gigi. God bless, God bless me with her. She was a God gift to me. And I thank God for Gigi. Gigi is my lifesaver. And I ain't got to explain to y'all, you know, what I'm talking about. But Gigi is, she's healthy. I take her to the vet. And if you want to know how I'm going to provide for my child, God will help me. But, you know, I love each and every one of y'all. And Babe would like to say something too. As soon as he get done. Because, you know, we're just talking. I'm not here to... to Tell nobody off. I'm really not. I'm not here to tell nobody off. But if I ask you to pray for me, and if you can, then I greatly appreciate it. But if you can't pray for me, if you can't pray for me, then do like this. That's all you got to do. Now, I'm going to let babe say something. From the pages from the Bible, I don't have to go to no description to tell, it, tell you about it. But, you see, God is a God of may gods. And God is no respect to person. He do, he do for one as well, so he do another. Now, we have love for one another. Amen. If you don't love one another, God's going to step in and something's going to happen. Amen. Always will. God ain't no play period. Mm -mm. God, God wants you to have a kid to bring into the world, you're going to bring it. Don't care who it is. Satan can't stop it. He told Satan before he had more souls than him, he'll turn rocks and stones into souls. Amen. You think about it from time to time. It'll come to you. Some of you going to shed some tears for after a while, but hey, that's between y'all and God. Amen. I didn't come to be no jerk and jerk. I come to tell you the truth. He said, have love for one another. Jesus said it in his own self. Have love for one another. And by this sign, all men shall know you are my disciples. How can you tell them something if you don't know for yourself? How can you tell someone something you don't know what you're talking about yourself? You got to first go and ask someone and learn it. And if you learn it the wrong way, you, you hurt somebody else with what you're trying to learn. But he said, have love for one another. Amen. No, no one on the face of the earth can tell who's going to bring a baby in the world and who's not. God only can do that himself. Amen. Now. I'm just going to say these two things to y'all and what y'all to remember about. If it hadn't been for babies, there wouldn't be no human walking on the face of the earth. You think about it. If it hadn't been for babies, there would be no humans coming in walking on earth. A woman is the most precious thing in the world. Mm -hmm. God made man first and then he made woman. Think about it. Amen. I don't care how good your woman look. 
How good she act. If that heart ain't right, God's going to turn a deaf ear to it. Amen. If that man's soul ain't right, God's going to turn a deaf ear to it. Amen. You can't fool God. He knows everything. He's the one that made the whole wide world by himself. Amen. He spoke everything into existence. And it ain't going to be too long before he's going to call time on the whole wide world. And we all got to face him for ourselves. You and me and everybody else come in this world. You got to face God for yourself. Amen. You can't holler what somebody else said and did. You got to stand on your own time. Answer for what you say and do. He said, have love for one another. And so, Father, I just want to let the world know. Lord Jesus, I just want to let the world know. Our Father, which are in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done in earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. And forgive us of our debt as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. But down in the kingdom, in the power, in the glory forever. Amen. Amen. God amen. has spoken. Let the church say amen. And another thing, you know, I'm not a I'm not a I'm not a I'm not a bad person. I'm not a messy person, but you know what? I will speak up for myself, and you know I will speak the truth. You know, and if you're gonna be happy for me, be happy for me. But if you can't be happy for me, then do like this: bag away. Don't come. Don't come to my channel. I know I'm going to get some thumbs down. Where did that come from? But I love each and every one of y'all. I really do. You know, and I know some of you all, y'all praying for me, and I greatly appreciate it. Babe, greatly appreciate it too. Amen. But, you know, some... They wanna, they wanna, they wanna add their little few senses in. Oh, you, they, I'm speaking the truth. I'm, you know, if you speaking the truth, you would say, well, you know, it's not. You know what? I'm gonna say it like this: It's not your decision to say, well, oh, you asked me to pray for you, that God bring. Let let you bring a baby into, you know, that mess. What mess is I'm starting? Oh, because I come back and I come in to what you said. I'm grown too. But you know what? If I didn't know how to take care of my kids, like I'm going to say again, if I didn't know how to take care of my kids when I was babysitting, I babysit it. I babysitted other people's kids. I babysitted my brother's kids. Even when I was in high school. But you know what? I don't come on here, you know, like that every time. I could tell y'all some things that y'all wouldn't even believe. But I done babysit it other people's kids. I done babysitted my brother's kids. When I was younger, I was still in school. I even told babe about it. I was losing sleep because I was babysitting my nephews. My nephews, yes. Am I right, babe? Right, I told you about it. Yeah. Them kids weren't even none of mine. They was my brothers and his wife. But look who took care of them. I could have raised them boys up. But you know what? I'm praying for my nephews. 
That's all I can do because I'm not ain't it. I care for them. So you don't know nothing about me, what I can't do, what I can do. But you know what? I'm not that kind of person to start that. Start that kind of stuff. I'm not. Gigi is well taken care of. Amen. Babe would tell you. Amen. I don't let Gigi go around starving. Gigi has dog food. I give Gigi a bath. I really do. I take her to the vet. If I feel like Gigi is getting sick, yeah, I'm going to take her to the vet. And you know how to take care of babies. And I know how to take care of babies. But if you want to think off in your mind, like, oh, how you going to provide for your child? You know what? I'm going to let you know something. God will help me to provide for my child. Amen. All I got to do is just pray to God and say, Lord, Help me. God, God will make a way to help me to provide for my child. And another thing, if you're worried about somebody not having a bed, won't you help us buy us one? Maybe that'll answer your question. So, since you want to be like that. Won't you won't you help me and babe get us a bed? Help us to get a bed. Since you wanna be so, you know, all of that. But you know what? I'm I'm not I'm not gonna even go there with you. Cause you know what? I'm just gonna pray for you. Amen. Cause I ain't got time for that. Not right here on my channel. This is gonna be my family channel. But you want me you don't want me to bring mess over there to your channel. But you bring mess over here to my channel. Tell my you ain't even got no bed. Don't worry about me. Worry about yourself. Quit worrying about other people. Worry about yourself first. Let's pray for one another. Let's love one another. If somebody come on, on YouTube and say, can you pray for me? Stop what you're doing and pray for that person. God don't like ugly. And he sure ain't crazy about pretty. But if you're going to be here on my channel, then be here for me. If you're not, then, then don't say nothing. But if you're going to pray for me, pray for me. That's what we're supposed to do. We're supposed to pray for one another. Don't put nobody down, you know, because this person wants to become a mother. Or that person wants to, you know, do something better with their lives. Pray for that person. Pray for them. Oh, all because of, you know... You can't even keep no internet. You know what? I can keep internet. I can. What can you do? But you know what? I'm not that kind of person to talk about nobody. To, you know, leave comments, you know, about somebody. But I will speak the truth. I will stand up for myself. I'm not going to let nobody steal my joy. I'm not going to let nobody stop my blessing. I'm really not. And if you can't pray for me, then all you got to do is just do like this. Keep your mouth shut and move on. I'm not mad. I'm really not. I used to let things get to me. And if you want to think I'm hiding something, if you have my number, I would call you if I had.